And developing right now, construction crews working on I-4 throughout the night, trying to prevent more headaches for drivers. The area right near Princeton Street flooding during some recent rains. We got the news station, Sydney Cameron, live in Orange County with all those details for us as uh, the rush hour is getting set to get cranked up. Hey, Sydney. Good morning. Well, if you have ever driven through this area during heavy rain, you know how bad the flooding can get on I-4 near Princeton Street. But now crews are working to change those traffic patterns to hopefully prevent future problems. Flooding on I-4 westbound. This photo is from last week when we saw heavy rain. You can't see it lanes at all. Drivers now avoiding I-4 at all costs when it rains. Makes people drive even crazier than they do already on I-4. Crews working through the night to make sure that flooding does not happen again. The Florida Department of Transportation closed down the right lane of I-4 west near Princeton Street so contractors can install pumps to get rid of some of the water. Contractor SGL saying in a state Statement, they will change traffic patterns because of the flooding. That includes moving westbound traffic into a new configuration that will avoid the flood prone areas and speeding up the timeline to shift eastbound traffic to the newly elevated permanent road. FDOT and SGL are still working on a long term solution, but they say these current changes are going to allow them to work more quickly in case they have to close more lanes, in case there is more flooding. Of course, we are expecting more rain and storms today and throughout the week. Reporting live in Orlando, Sydney Cameron, Fox 35 News.